hey y'all and welcome back to my channel my name is ashanti if this is your first time here if it's not your first time here welcome back say hey hey and y'all um today we're taking a trip to home goods um we're currently leaving my mom's we stayed here last night because my ac went out so i'm currently waiting for my brother to come get in the car with me because you know if i gotta pick up anything heavy you know he's gonna be my extra set of hands so waiting on him but um first before we go to home goods i'm gonna stop by the apartment to see if they done fixing my ac because if not like what's taking y'all so long and because i need to change because i still have on kind of like the clothes i was supposed to wear to work today ended up not going to work because when i went to drop mike off for school they were like he has a fever but as y'all can see he's perfectly fine what did we even go to the store for for some stuff. Where is some stuff? Say hey. No. See, he get up in here with an attitude. I ain't got no attitude. I just ain't finna say hey to nobody I don't know. The, uh, Michael saying hey. Okay, he don't know no better. Whatever. Okay, y'all, so we just made it to Marshall's and Home Goods. Hi! Hi. <laughs> uh, after, uh, okay, so I went in the apartment. The AC was going. Um, I caught the maintenance man. I'm glad I did because I was gonna go right up in the office and tell him, sir, when you come up out of this apartment, you turn these lights off. Cause literally every light was on. The foyer, the stairs, the kitchen, the living room, and in Michael's bathroom, like, sir, you do not need all of these lights. You working in one spot. The thermostat is in one spot. So I had to tell him, when you come up out of here, turn these lights off. But uh, he was saying that he got the AC fixed and everything. He's about to replace the thermostat. But now we're about to go up in the store, see what we can find. So. I see y'all when we get inside. Michael then turned on these windshield wipers, Lord. Movie. Whoa, watch a movie. I watch a movie. I watch a movie. I watch a movie. Trying to see which mirror I like because that was the main reason why I came in here was for a mirror. No. Say hey. Hey. You like this mirror? No. You like this one? No. You don't like this one? No. You don't like any of them? No. What you like? No. Okay, so we got a mirror picked out. My brother took it to the front because it wouldn't fit in the basket. But um, now I need to find little baskets for the bathrooms and then um, little inserts for my new dresser because the top is like for jewelry. Yes, Micah. Okay, we see it. We see it. Stop pulling it out. But yeah, so I'm trying to find like little jewelry organizers to go in the top drawer of my dresser. Do you like this basket for Micah's bathroom? Hey, <laughs> Do you want this for the back of your toilet to put your wipes and toilet paper in? What is on your shirt? Oh, we gotta change you. I gotta change you, Do you like this basket, yes or no? Oh, I want the movie. I want the movie. Ma hey, Mike. Hey, Mike. Bye. Go. Bye. 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 Why you didn't leave that up there? Because I never went up there. Why? What is it? What is what? This. Body wash. What? Okay. I think so. This is perfect. Yeah, he's recording. Give it here. Watch your movie. Wake up. Watch your movie. Hey, watch your movie now. You watching your movie? Okay, y'all, we just left Home Goods. Got, um, I got a few things. I'm gonna do like a little haul whenever I get home, but pick up. Oh, I closed that bag too. I was just about to show y'all this fire candy that I got from by the register, and it's all over the car. Oh, no. But, anyways, like I was saying, uh, I'll show y'all like everything that I got when I get home, and then of course, I'll show y'all where I end up putting it. It's not that much stuff. I mean, I went in to get the stuff that I already knew that I needed. Oh my god. 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 O
Okay, y'all, so we're home. I just gave Michael a bath. He's in the tub clean. So I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all um, what all I got from home goods because some of it is going here in his bathroom. So if y'all hear him, he over here playing with the suction thing with the water. So Okay, so I got these baskets and they're gonna be going on the back of the toilet. I'm not sure which is gonna be going in which restroom, but I'm thinking since this one is bigger, um, it'll probably go here in Micah's because I'm gonna put his pull-ups and then probably toilet paper and wipes in here until I can find um, like a little white, a white case or something that's a little bit better looking than just a pack of wipes. And then in mine, it's just gonna have toilet paper and then like the little toilet wipes, the little flushable ones. And then I got one more thing I'm gonna go grab real quick. Okay, so the last thing that I got outside of the mirror because I'm waiting for my brother to come bring that upstairs for me. So we got Micah this little chair because we're taking him somewhere this weekend that he hasn't been before. So wanted to make sure he had his own little chair and then it came with, of course, the little sleeve. So before I went inside of the store, I gave myself like a mental budget of $100 and I didn't even spend 80. So I did pretty good. Okay, so I got his chair all tucked away in the sleeve. This is actually going back in the back of my car. So I just brought it in so I could show it to y'all. But I'm about to get him situated for bed and then I'll continue this in probably about 20 minutes. Okay, so I went ahead and stuck what's going in Micah's basket in there. And of course, like I said, he just has toilet paper, which isn't really for him at the moment. Then wipes and his extra pull-ups. And then he just has this little um, Paw Patrol bucket, which he got from a birthday party. But I just use it to stick his little bath toys in there. Ooh. But overall, um, that's how it's looking. So I do think it looks a little more put together than just having the pull-ups and the wipes there. And I do want to still find a wipe dispenser to go like on either side of it. Okay, so the basket that I chose to go in here actually fits like on the toilet pretty perfectly. I think I'm gonna just go ahead and like stack or not stack, but like put three rolls of toilet paper, like two at the bottom and one on the top. And then after looking down here, I realized that I'm actually out of the little um, toilet wipes. So I already have to take a trip to Target tomorrow. So I'm gonna just go ahead and add that to the list. Let me go ahead and make sure that it's gonna fit. Yeah, it's pretty lengthy. So I figured it would. And then just sit that one right there on top. I think that looks pretty good for now. I'll probably um, take the one off top and stick the wipes in the middle once I get those. But that's what we got for now. Nothing fancy, but keeps me from having to rustle all up under the cabinet when I need more toilet paper. Okay, so for my room, this is the mirror that I ended up choosing. This is like the only thing I hate about shopping at like Marshalls, Home Goods, and like Ross, those kind of stores, is that they always put the stickers right on the product like they really could have stuck that on the back but i would highly recommend home goods if, if you need like a full body mirror or like a full length floor mirror because they are pretty cheap there like of course they have like more expensive ones but for the most part they're all below a hundred dollars and i think this is a pretty good size for me i liked this one <laughs> micah liked the i was trying to get his input so he could like kind of be um like engaged while we were there so he wouldn't be like as bored but yeah so update on my room i still have my desk slash vanity because i kind of made it into a vanity when i had it at my granny's house but i broke the legs to it in the process of moving so i don't know if i'm gonna keep it and try to replace it or try to re replace the legs or just get a whole new like thing to use as a vanity but Whatever I choose to do is gonna go right here. And then I'm gonna mount my TV like right here. It can't go too high up because whatever this thing is right here on the ceiling. So it'll be mounted just about right there. I think that's like all that I have left to do in here in my room is getting a TV mounted and then the little desk or whatever I choose to put right here. And I might get like a canvas or something to go above the bed. And I actually keep moving the bed from wall to wall. I moved it to this wall because it had more space, but 
when you have like such a spacious wall, it looks empty. So I just moved it back over here. That way I could put the mirror in that corner and it would look good like during the daytime if I ever wanted to take a picture or something, the daylight is coming in that direction. So it just made more sense for me to do that. But um, I guess I'll go ahead and give y'all a quick update on like what's going on in the living room. They finally came and fixed the big old hole I had in the ceiling, so. Okay, so, oh my God, my shadow looks huge. Okay, so I have a 55 inch TV that's gonna go right here on this wall. Um, I didn't wanna get anything too big because I kinda do wanna still like utilize the rest of this space here in the living room. Um, I think I'm gonna just go ahead and do bar stools instead of trying to put another like sofa. Also, Micah wrote on the couch with dry erase markers. So if y'all have any remedies, please let me know. But um, yeah, so the TV is gonna get mounted. I actually have the mount there. So my brother's gonna come mount it for me. And then under the TV, I got a floating um, fireplace. I'll insert a picture so y'all can see like what it looks like and y'all can see what I'm talking about. But I feel like once that goes up, like the TV with the fireplace, it's definitely gonna create like a vibe you can change the colors and everything on the fireplace so i think that's gonna be pretty cool and now that they finally fixed that big old hole situation that i had up there i could finally put up my dining table which is also coming in the mail um i think the dining table and the fireplace are supposed to get here on the same day so that's what's gonna go right here and of course like once everything is in its place y'all will see what everything looks like when i do the furniture department tour but yeah, that's what we have going on for now. So a lot of stuff still in the process, but since everything, hold on, let me flip the camera. So yeah, like a lot of stuff is still in the process, but I feel like since everything is already like going and on its way here, it's not gonna take that long. Like my brother is basically like Mr. Handyman, Mr. Fixie, Handyman, Bob the Builder, like whatever you wanna call him. So um, I think those are the last few touches that I have to do. And then of course my dresser in my closet, but I'm gonna do a separate video for my closet altogether because um, I think that's probably gonna be the biggest makeover because what it's looking like now, what it's gonna look like when it's done is totally different, so. Oh, I also forgot, Micah's new bed is coming in the mail also. I got so much stuff coming in the mail, like. Okay, so Micah is getting a loft bed. That way, um, like it's kind of like a bunk bed, but I could still utilize that space under his bed to like store his toys and all this. So it still has like an aesthetic and it's still organized and looks put together. Um, and then I think that's, that's all that's going into Micah's room. I don't know if I'm gonna put anything up on the wall because his, like since he's, has, since he's gonna have a bunk bed, it'll be like taller up on the wall. And then I'm not very fond of like putting stuff above the baby crib because if someone follow him my baby i'm gonna be so upset so yeah i don't think i'm gonna do anything else in there besides like putting in maybe organizers um i've been looking for like a rocking chair or a glider to put in the corner in their room that way like i can have somewhere to sit while i'm in there and i'm probably gonna be breastfeeding so definitely gonna need somewhere to sit but yeah i'll insert pictures of everything that i don't have yet but that's in the process of making it here so y'all can kind of like have an idea of what I'm talking about. Okay, y'all. So that's going to be it for today's little vloggy vlog slash video. So thank y'all so much for tuning in. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you have not already. And I will see y'all in my next video. Bye. Mm -hmm.